Just did arc trainer and then of course was jogging on the treadmill and now we're gonna lift and I'm supposed to do low bar squats today I got my knee sleeves this time I you know before I've been working with 70 kilograms and I want to be working with 80 so that's what we're gonna do today I mean I did it last time too but I just want to keep it a constant thing you know <laughs> this is gonna be so weird but when I was leaving the house to come here today my dad had on Sweeney Todd. I love that musical. I love the soundtrack. So I've been listening to that this entire workout. <laughs> Another like 10 days until I'm back in London. And I just want to like maximize my time. You know, I got, I also scheduled the DEXA scan. So that's coming. Okay, I gotta, I gotta squat. So let's go squat. Perfect cheat code. Social distance, shoddy. Don't get close to people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Had a lot of problems, but I couldn't keep them. I've been on a way so big to wipe out lethal. Switch it up, Ay. take it slow, take it slow. Bring it back, bring it back. Let them know, let them know. Bring it down to the flow, to the flow. Pick it up, pick it up. Let it go, let it go, baby. Back on the grind. Don't shake my shine. You could do me. bother me but i get money yeah like it falls from trees i just want to dance i just want to sing it feels so awkward it's supposed to be a close grip bench press work on my triceps i don't know but it feels interesting <laughs> but i take my time it'll come to me you could have it all but it's hard to keep switch it up take it slow take it slow bring it back this lighting is not the best i'm kind of tired i don't know why i've been working all morning um but i'm here i drove out my sister lives out north slightly outside of uh, los angeles she's in the valley and so i drove out here to meet with her today we're meeting at a chili's she's bringing my nephew my sister had a freaking baby she had a baby it's crazy she's the first one of us like out of my little family you know um she's the first one to have a kid and so yeah she had him in December and um, it's my first time meeting him she's gonna be here she said in about five minutes so I'm about to just go inside and you know get us a table or whatever look at the nephew and the sister
I am meeting up with Aisha. She's one of my clients. I would say consider her a friend. She's just like the sweetest person. I just love her whole vibe, her whole aura. Like you ever meet someone and you're just like, wow, like you just feel their spirit. You're just like, this is a good person. Like she's, I don't know. I love her, long story short, okay? And yeah, I'm in LA clearly and things have been so busy. Well, I didn't rent a car to start. <laughs> had a lot of work to do so for the first week honestly I've really just been keeping to family keeping to myself going to the gym seeing family doing little things here and there um, but I haven't really seen other people I haven't seen a Jazzy yet I haven't met up with anyone that really wasn't family other than like my friend Kristen of course like we, we did dinner but she's basically family we've been friends for like 10 plus years but um my schedule's opening up a bit more and so yeah um, a Jazzy hit me up and we're making plans to like link up, maybe hit the gym together and hang out. Me and Aisha are meeting today. So it's exciting. I wish I could see Nikki. She's in San Diego and I know I'm just going to have to wait until I'm out here again. Same thing with Jasmine. I can tell she's really busy. But every time I come to LA, I always see Jasmine. Um, I wish I could see Tay, you know. Um, I don't know if you guys follow her. But I work with her as well and she's just like, she's just so dope. Like <laughs> just another person. I've actually never met her in person, but she's just someone else that, you know, I'm like, I know we would be friends. <laughs> but yeah, um, so I'm getting ready to see Aisha. I don't have that much time, honestly, but I want to look halfway decent because she is just so gorgeous and so flawless. Like, like I don't want to stand next to her and look like a munchkin, you know? So. <laughs> So I'm like, let me do my skincare. Um, maybe put on a little foundation or something. Let's get ready. keep telling myself oh be more strict stick to what you've been eating clearly I don't have a food scale here so I haven't been tracking my calories but I've just been cooking the same things I was cooking back in the UK and there's been a few times of course where I've eaten out and I just even getting back to the UK yeah let's just hope that we have maintained or if there's a little bit of a gain like it's just water retention or whatever like it's not that big a deal I'm not gonna cry over it regardless I'm enjoying myself I'm doing what I can in moderation we just keep pushing from there and we'll see we'll see we'll see but either way I'm really proud and happy of just how things have been like I'm not crazy indulging I'm not gaining a bunch of weight. Last time I came to LA, I swear I gained like 20 pounds. And I'm sure not all of it was fat, of course. But even the bloat and stuff, it just had me feeling ridiculous. And even when you when it comes to like just eating out that regularly and getting your body used to those like addictive sugars and fats and oils. I was in LA for two months last year, two and a half months, gained a bunch of weight, got back to London. And it took me a long time to like fight off those cravings because I had like kind of reawoken them low key in LA, right? Like, and um, it just took a while to get back on track. And so I just didn't want that to happen again, you know? And yeah, so far so good. these dresses that I really like but big boob life I know those of you know no <laughs> let's see if we can get this one in but some sandals I'm gonna throw these on and we're gonna go meet Aisha
on camera, so. You guys, it's been two years since we've seen each other. Has it been? Oh my god, you're right. Years, over two years. You're right. I was, like, I was at your house, yeah, right? it's been like three years probably. Oh that's my god. Wild. But I mean, we also talk to each other like on a weekly basis. Yeah, that's true. Look at this view. That's a view. I, bruh, look at this view. Look at where she took us. I've been in LA my whole life, and this girl knows the city better than I do. You know, I feel like I just got back from lunch, and well, the brunch thing with Aisha. I'm sitting in the parking garage. I need to go. Um, Gotta run some errands today and do some edits and stuff. But I just wanted to check in because it was so lovely seeing her, hanging out with her, being with her. Like, so much fun. This place was gorgeous. The food was good. I mean, A1 company, A1 food, A1 location. Like, this was, it was really nice. But we're about to head back on the road. I got a lot of things to do today it's my stepmom's birthday and so I wanted to go to a bakery to pick her up some just some stuff take it to her at the job I want to hit the gym like I said still but yeah just this was fun it was so nice catching up with her I can't believe it had been so long since I seen her she was saying I haven't seen her in three or four years I'm like is that accurate like and I doing the math I guess so like COVID really just stole life away because I'm like I guess so <laughs> that's crazy man but she was so sweet she's like you look so good I do know when I did see her the last time I saw her I was pretty big I mean I'm losing weight so clearly I you know my weight fluctuates goes up and down but I was definitely on a way heavier end the last time I saw her so let's go yeah, I'm like an addict, do I gotta have it? I ain't even playing, got a really bad habit. If it moves, gotta grab it. Fuse like a magnet, lose won't have it till I'm doomed in a casket. I ain't playing, got a weird mind. If you work eight hours, I'ma work nine. If the shit tastes sour, you should taste mine. I'ma stay in power for a long time. Get up, nah, I ain't a quitter. Toss me the ball, I'm a really big hitter. Big picture, I'm a straight killer. Rice in the song to the highest bidder. Got juice, got gas, I'ma move fast. New shoes, new tracks, like who's that? I'm new, come back better than last. Yeah, it's a new me, never gonna look back. You never gonna look back. Cause damn, I was built to last. You move slow when I move fast, and that's facts. Only I can make a change. Slowly take a step today. I don't even know what today is, but hey. <laughs> I am going to check out my cousin's store. I have a cousin, she just opened her own beauty supply store. So a black owned beauty supply. And I'm like so excited to see her store. I'm so proud of her. Family doing big things like her store, my homeboy from high school, his gym. It's just amazing like seeing people like build stuff like this, you know? Look at this. Wow, it's so bright. This color needs to adjust. Fix yourself. Here, y'all. This is so cool. She opened a whole ass store. That's crazy. That's crazy. So proud of you. So proud of you. That's my family. My family done did this. My family done did this. So you in LA, come through, black owned business, support, curly girl love beauty. This is so cool, it's just my heart, my heart. Look at Jojo, you're so big. You're so big. What? At my cousin's, the beauty shop owner. Get her lovely family. All right, there's her stuff. Hi. Hi. You like socks? No?
I am really out here trying to make the most of the last like week that I have left. Um, first of all, I had to extend my trip because my passport is expired and I'm getting it renewed, but it's taking longer. I had to extend the trip. So I only have like five more days left and I signed up for that DEXA scan. I signed up for the DEXA scan. I feel like I should have did the DEXA scan like when I first arrived instead of waiting to the end of my trip. All I see is the blow in my face and that's all I see. Yeah, I haven't been tracking much of anything and I've been eating out so, so much. And it's kind of nice, but at the same time, my body isn't loving it. Um, we had Olive Garden and, oh my God. Like even thinking about it gets me a little sick. We got this pasta and it tasted fine, but at the same time while eating it, I could just taste all the oil. It was just coated in oil. And it's kind of been happening every time I eat something. <laughs> Um, yeah, I'm enjoying it, but at the same time can immediately feel how it doesn't sit right inside of me. And then like the next day feeling sluggish, feeling down, not feeling, it's just, it's no bueno. I have half a mind to cancel the DEXA scan. I don't, I'm not going to, but part of me wanted to because because I have been eating out and I know that the scale is gonna be a bit up. <laughs> it's a bit interesting because sometimes I get anxiety or I get just a little over obsessive about the scale. But yeah, I'm feeling a little, this DEXA scan and I'm just like, I just wanna flush this out. And you know, I wanna get to London and I'm not gonna weigh myself or anything. I'm gonna stay away from the scale for about two weeks when I get back, but I just wanna get back into my routine lose this blow see you know by the time i get back on the scale see the weight going down again and that kind of stuff but yeah right now it's mission let's hope that this dexa scan doesn't send me into a downward spiral that's 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 where, that's where we're at right now <laughs> hi guys good afternoon i swear every day my face is just looking chubbier and chubbier but you know this is what happens when you eat all the foods and we're going to eat more foods that's what we're that's wrong that's that's what I'm on the way today. I am meeting up with my cousin slash home girl. And we're going to this brunch spot that I've heard of. We're gonna eat, I'm gonna get my nails done today. Just kind of like hang out with people as my time is coming to a close, nearing its end. I cannot wait to get back to London. I am feeling a little sick sometimes. I'm kind of dying to get back to London for that reason. I just miss like cooking all of my foods. So anyway, enough about that though. Yeah, I'm meeting up with my homegirl to eat out again. <laughs> Should be a good time. Puff, puff, puff. So pass me the Dutch. Pretty girl come. My mom, Jane Marie. Don't laugh at me. I don't. <laughs> I listen to Afro beats almost exclusively for the last couple years because it was a newer genre for me and I just love it. Half the time I don't know what they're saying though. So yes, I make up my own words, all right? Take me off that camera. You look cute. Show them your ponytail. No. <laughs> Why do you do this? <laughs> Can you turn the camera the other way so it just gets us driving? Oh my gosh. South Central. You know how they be having like City and Compton. They be having downtown LA, Miami. <laughs> we in South Central. The time lapse. <laughs> 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 so guys oh my god that food was so good I'm full and I want to work out today already <laughs> flat sole shoes that I can use to squat and stuff in since apparently for powerlifting you do have to wear shoes 
And as you guys know right now, I'm always going barefoot. So we're gonna buy some Vans or some Chucks or something. Think about getting these. I like that they're kind of high top, but I think I'm gonna get this shoe. I'm kind of bummed at the thought about like, I don't know. I hope they're just as comfortable as my bare feet. And I don't think it's gonna be, but <laughs> we'll see. I guess we have to be used to it either way because we plan to compete. Wow, so I did not do the best job vlogging today. <laughs> But I was with Karen and she didn't really want to be on camera. I am getting a rash and I don't know where it's from. I used to get like eczema if I was out in the sun for too long and stuff. Partly why I prefer cooler weather and why living in London was just like this is perfect. <laughs> Even though the brightness in LA is so pretty, living with actual sun 24 seven is just not the most comfortable feeling for me. Like I said, I didn't vlog a ton, gotta respect my girl's privacy. It was so much fun though. We went to Sephora. I did get some makeup that's one shade lighter. Um, because as I've been in London, my skin is definitely like lightening up a bit or it's not as tan, I guess. And so we'll see how that works. I'm still gonna use my current makeup as well. Maybe I'll just mix it and like, you know. But I did wanna get a couple things. So I got concealer, I got the blurring skin tint because that's the primary foundation I use. I like really lightweight foundations. Got that one from Fenty Beauty. Um, we were checking out some perfumes as well, but I didn't buy any, thank goodness. Cause I'm like, listen, I'm trying to stick to my budget. I already went shopping and bought so much stuff since I've been here in LA. Not to mention them $200 shoes that I can't even fit. I mean, they fit on my feet. They're just really uncomfortable. Like I can't work out with them, but I'll probably keep them and save them and use them for photos. Cause they're just like so white. And I'm like, you know what? These could be like photo taking shoes. <laughs> even though I'm not even really active on Instagram at the moment, I will be in the future. But right now it's just like, I can't deal with that app. It's just sucking up way too much of my time. <sighs> a lot of words. I am talking a lot, a lot, a lot. And yeah, I got the Vans, which I don't feel like, I was trying to get out the bag, but I just, I can't, I can't. And you could guess it, we are at the gym at 24 Hour Fitness. And I was like, you know what, let's test out these shoes. Like maybe I'll need to break them in. They felt comfortable, but I mean, actually squatting in them, like we'll just see. I've only ever squatted with my bare feet. Oh, I mean, I wear socks, but yeah, barefooted. I also have my lifting heels, but I don't like, they're not horrible to use, like they're not, but they change the way my body moves when I'm squatting. It makes it more of an upright squat, a more quad dominant squat when I've switched to low bar. And so it's just a little confusing whenever I use those shoes and I prefer low bar. So that's why Juan recommended like, start squatting with some shoes, find the shoes you wanna squat in, get comfortable in them because when you compete, you have to wear shoes. So we'll see if these are gonna be my shoes but i thought i'd test them out today do some squats i want to do a bunch of cardio i still just feel like really sweating clearly i mean look at this look at this bloat you guys oh my gosh <laughs> and my body just feels it too like i've really been craving doing a lot more cardio because i can just feel everything i'm eating in my system it doesn't feel the best so yeah i'll probably do some light cardio high reps light weight just for more cardiovascular approach as well. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna test out these shoes. I got Alani New, Island Crush. That's what we're using today. I'm gonna do about 20 to 30 minutes of um, cardio before I lift. Probably just like Stairmaster and the elliptical, something like that.
Okay, I can squat with these shoes. Definitely not horrible. Taking a little getting used to, but it's not bad at all. Like my feet feel pretty free. I tried on some like the vans that you that don't you don't they don't have shoelaces, but I felt like they were more narrow. And I have wide feet and I also like my feet to just really feel like spread out and like you know, as I'm used to squatting, like I said, barefoot. So I wanted a shoe that could replicate that same feeling where it's like spread out you know so it feels good let's see what we're doing today oh we're going to the park why are you going to the park what is that work out hmm? i think so so we got this park on aviation my brothers have been coming here like tossing around a football and running and stuff and they've been doing it like every Saturday that I've been here. So I thought I'd come this Saturday. It's my last Saturday in town. On your toes. That's too slow. <laughs> One. There you go. One. Two. There you go. Look at him get it. Up your feet there. There you go. You gotta go faster. There you go. I'm doing too many. I'm not jumping high. Two. No, I'm not. You are. You are. You are. You are. You are. Ashley just been for the first time, too. She can do it better than you guys. Oh, the guy hit him in the chest. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what he's doing. 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 Let's see what he's doing.